Ladies and gentlemen, dear colleagues, dear Eva Maria, Austria has been and will remain a strong supporter of the international human rights system. Together, we need to stand up against any attempts to undermine our open and free societies. Strong democracies are not afraid of strong opinions. Quite the contrary, democracies grow stronger when opinions and ideas can be shared freely and factual information is accessible to all. Open and free societies based on human rights and the rule of law are unthinkable without free, independent and pluralistic media. Today, democracy seems to be put into question in many regions of the world. And so is media freedom. We see democratic movements being met with force and repression. We see activists and journalists being persecuted and silenced, for example in Belarus, Hong Kong and Myanmar. Around the world, media workers are subject to physical attacks, kidnapping, torture and harassment, offline and online. Women journalists are particularly exposed to online harassment. The number of reporters jailed for the work hit a new global record. And in the past 12 months alone, 46 journalists were killed in connection with the work. What is more, 9 out of 10 of these killings go unpunished. As political leaders, it is our duty to join forces and put an end to this appalling immunity of attacks on journalists. Austria has therefore placed the promotion and protection of freedom of expression and the safety of journalists at the center of its human rights agenda. Ladies and gentlemen, today increased violence against journalists requires fresh momentum and renewed commitment to protect and defend media freedom freedom of expression and the safety of journalists. Against this worrying background, Austria pledges the following. First, Austria will host a high-level ministerial conference in November this year. This conference will mark the 10th anniversary of the United Nations Plan of Action on the Safety of Journalists. We will prepare this conference in close cooperation with the Media Freedom Coalition and I'm already looking forward to welcoming you all in Vienna coming November. Together, we have to make sure that this action plan of the United Nations remains the blueprint of our common efforts to prevent, protect and persecute crimes against journalists and free media, also over the coming decade. Secondly, I can announce a contribution by Austria of €10,000 to the Global Media Defense Fund in order to support civil society initiatives to promote a free, safe and enabling environment for independent journalism. To conclude, I would like to thank Eva Maria and Estonia, as well as the co-chairs of the Media Freedom Coalition for their efforts and initiatives. Together we will continue to fight for media freedom and for free, independent and pluralistic societies. Thank you very much.